The Monument website is composed of a convoluted and complex web of different services. Content management systems like Contentful, WordPress, Drupal for content, e-commerce data with sources like Shopify, BigCommerce, and WooCommerce are used to build engaging commerce experiences. Assembling a performant, composable website from these disparate data sources is a very challenging endeavor. Teams spend time reading API docs, waste cycles ensuring that it scales and is configured just so, and ultimately end up building their own data layer. But even further, there's the reality that legacy APIs and legacy content sources were never designed to be used for composable architectures, and it means that they are prone to failure and ultimately do not scale to the needs of modern teams. So thus, teams with a need for speed that are sold on the benefits of modern composable architectures have been left stranded until today. Enter Valhalla Content Hub. Valhalla Content Hub makes content synchronization from hundreds of data sources a breeze. It enables teams to come with their content sources of today and experiment with the content sources of tomorrow with newer, more innovative CMSs. It enables development teams to de-risk their technical future by providing a unified GraphQL API that can be combined to leverage any front-end framework, no matter what is in vogue today, tomorrow, and in the future. It unifies all content sources in a reusable, unified GraphQL API that can be leveraged across all different rendering modes, including at build time, runtime, and everything in between as well as usable via other use cases beyond just the content web, including native apps and other digital transformation projects. But don't just take our word for it. Let's get to it and let's show and not just merely tell with a demo. In this demo, we'll be leveraging two key features of Valhalla, accelerated sourcing and the unified GraphQL API. We'll show how content can be sourced from three different data sources, leveraging Contentful and WordPress as CMSs and Shopify for commerce data. We'll show how content is sourced and updated in our new content hub. And then we'll show how the unified GraphQL API can be used to build performance-focused websites in Next.js, Astro, and Gatsby. Let's do this thing. First, let's show our resulting website, Pet Snuggles. It may seem like a simple website, but beyond the tip of the iceberg is a fair bit of complexity that Valhalla helps your teams manage. Pet Snuggles is a statically-generated website powered by Valhalla and Gatsby. For performance reasons, we source all of these pets from Contentful and then generate the Gatsby site. But further than that, each view of the website demonstrates a different content source. Our marketing team wanted a newsroom, so we use WordPress for its familiar ease of use for publishing the latest pet news. Our finance team wanted us to commercialize, so we added the ability to rent time with these superstars, powered by Shopify. Our team wanted to build this site as quickly as possible, so we leverage Valhalla's source plugin ecosystem, and all content sources are configured in just a few lines of JavaScript without looking up a single API doc. Next, let's walk through the user interface of Valhalla Content Hub. You can see that there's a new tab in our UI labeled Content Hub. This is the decoupled sourcing step from disparate data sources with a full log of all events. This contains all updates to the data layer and specifically can be thought of as a cache between direct data access of the CMS or commerce solution. With this layer in between the content management system and the front end website, the CMS itself is leveraged far less frequently and only for incremental data fetches, not full updates. Now let's say I'm a content editor and I notice something that I need to fix. Clearly, we can see Palo here as a kitten and not a puppy. Whoops, this will not stand. Let's update and publish with Contentful and then pop back over to Content Hub. This leverages our incremental data fetching system and only what changed between the last time we cached and the data has been fetched. No more and no less. Speed up data fetching and reduce strain and latency on the content source. As we can now see, the content has been updated and the resulting website has been built and published in seconds, available to all users throughout the globe. Accelerated sourcing speeds up data sourcing by over 50% and increases uptime and reduces latency in decoupled builds. In effect, it enables legacy CMSs to perform as well as the best ones and scale the composable web, regardless of the quality of your content source. Now let's leverage the next and potentially even bigger innovation of Valhalla, the unified GraphQL API. Accelerated sourcing and specifically this content hub not only cache the data to share between builds, it also produced a shareable live GraphQL API that lives beyond the build. We can use this GraphQL API to demonstrate the power of Valhalla with any front-end framework. First, let's show Next.js. This is leveraging idiomatic Next.js conventions for sourcing data, alongside the Valhalla API to power and make building the Next.js site from these content sources easy and seamless. Now let's hop over to Astro. Astro, the front-end framework that claims to pull content from anywhere. Well, let's pull it from Valhalla API. So you may be asking yourself, you know, what really changed in these demos? Aren't they kind of the same? Yup. The goal of the Hala API is to swallow the complexity of the composable web 
and enable teams to continue to use tools on both ends if they prefer. CMSs of choice, front-end frameworks of choice, and stitch together the data sources in a unified GraphQL API that can be used to build websites, web apps, native apps, and beyond. Bahala, the enterprise content hub to modernize your web stack.